Daycare for kids? Well, that's probably something you've got to do. Daycare for dogs? Now that's a splurge. Josh Sneed delves into the world of doggy daycare during his trip to Dog Days of Birmingham. All right, so I have two dogs. I love them to death, I'd do anything for them. But when I leave the house, I put them in a crate, which is something I thought all dog owners do in some form or another. But not necessarily. Melinda Carter is also a dog owner, but when she goes to work, she takes her dogs to daycare. Doggy daycare. She loves her dog Parker so much that she takes him to Dog Days of Birmingham. So on today's segment of People Pay For That, we look at the world of the pampered dog and make me feel like a horrible dog owner. Okay, so Melinda, why don't you tell me about Parker? Well, I've had Parker for about five and a half years now. He's a rescue. He's a boxer bull mastiff mix. Bull mastiffs can be huge, right? Yes, he's a big boy. What do you look for in a place that you're gonna leave your dog? Well, um, the, probably the most important thing is just the, the love that the staff has for, for my dog. Um, I want him to be treated like I treat him at home. I want him to feel comfortable there. And the staff is actually really good at, at kind of understanding him and, and knowing like, what mood he's in and, yeah. and where he wants to be. Wow. So they do it, yeah, they do a great job of taking care of him. All right, so Mr. Johns, how long have you guys been here? Uh, this September will be two years we've uh, been, been in this facility. Okay, two years. Mm -hmm. So what'd you do before you? Before this, uh, uh, surprisingly say, I was middle management in a software development company. Really? I was the techie. There's three things that we do here. One is daycare, one is boarding, and one is grooming. We sell a full day of daycare, starts at 7 a.m. and we close at 6 p.m. So your dog could be here for 11 hours. Hey. Hey, Blue. For boarding, leaving with a family member is still probably number one, but that's not always available. Uh, there's just so many dogs I've talked to some vets that in Thanksgiving, they'll have 140 dogs boarding and they're maxed out and we'll get some of their overflow. So it's just so many dogs, it's, it's enough to go around. It's not a problem. I think we're about to round second base here. This is... <laughs> okay, let's see if you can name all the dogs in here. All right, Bruno, Blue, Milo, Addie, Buddy, AJ, Oscar, Georgia, Ripley, Sophie, Teddy, and Mary. Now Dog Days sells their services and packages, so you can get 20 full days of daycare for $420, and overnight cageless boarding for $42. But if you're a dog owner like Melinda, that peace of mind seems worth it. When you have a dog, especially when you have a younger dog that needs a lot of exercise, it's an amazing way for them to get that exercise that they need when you're away from home every day during you know, work hours. Then you don't have to you know, run, run them for an hour when yeah. you get home from work after yeah. a long day. Here's where the grooming's going. This is the turbo dryer, huh? You're not kidding. No. You're not kidding. <laughs> All right. It's like going through the last part of the car wash. If you think the dogs just lay around all day, well, you should come upstairs. Check out the roof. You're free. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh. So this is the roof. This is where they come and play. Dog sucker. Dog sucker! Oh! oh. Go! Uh, don't drink that. He was just laying in here, man. Come on, brother. Oh, you're stronger than me. This is embarrassing. <laughs> I can't not get this away from me. I'm just letting you win so you build confidence. Don't tell anybody, okay? Please don't tell anybody. Good, you look refreshed. Nothing like a rooftop pool. Well, Jim, I'm wet. 
<laughs> smell like dogs. You smell like dogs. You bathe the dogs. Yeah. Uh, you played with dogs. Yeah. So uh, now you know all there is to know about taking care of dogs. Yeah. We appreciate fine. you showing us around. You're quite welcome. Right, thanks, thanks for coming. All right.